right, testing, testing. Testing. Oh, that word I just put the little pop out chat thingy. Okay. Testing. I'm sad. We're drawing something to make me still feel sad because I'm stupid. <laughs> oh, hello. All right, I have been told I am audible this time. I'm still traumatized. <laughs> I would like to give a shout out to the one dude who watched the entirety of that Minecraft stream, unable to hear any fucking thing I was saying, and just kept watching for the entire stream. He is a Chad. <laughs> All right, today we are drawing Yui because I'm sad and she's cute and I'm still sad. <laughs> okay, I, I don't know if I have like any life advice to anyone. It's, hey, before you're going to do public speaking, maybe don't watch something that's going to make you cry your eyes out. <laughs> also, I'm fucking awful at anatomy. I'm sorry if you came here expecting, like, Ina levels of art prowess. I, I am not that. <laughs> you don't understand how long it took to draw the Brimtone models. <laughs> A lot of that was just guesstimate. I picked a really complicated pose, which I'm, I'm stupid for doing. <laughs> I don't know why I picked such a sad anime to rewatch. I've watched it before and it's still funny. It's really depressing, but it's kind of funny. And then it's Friday. I was like, oh, hell yeah, I could do a stream. And no, I'm stupid. I finished it. <laughs> I would have started like two hours ago. Okay, you, listen. You think those boots are bad. You think those boots are bad. <laughs> Look at these things. Look at these things. I did this to myself. <laughs> I fucking, I love, I love the strappy boots. I love them so much. I wear them all the time. It's just, God, I really did not do myself any favors. This probably does not look, or is probably not accurate at all, but I'm just drawing to not sad anymore. <laughs> I think this is how legs work. You know, we're gonna do this. Legs. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> See, I am also the bad at draw. That's the problem. <laughs> I don't know anything about anatomy. I just kind of go, that looks like a person vaguely, and then that's it. That's my that's my art style. I think I need to fix this. I need to fix this. I'm trying to think of other sad anime. I don't know, this is, I, I usually avoid really sad ones. I, I was pretty much forced to watch all of the really like sad and messed up ones. I, I watched Steins Gate. I loved Steins Gate. It was not my idea to watch Steins Gate. <laughs> that was, that was like government assigned to me. And I'm still sad about it. <laughs> The flip trick is my best friend. We all stand the flip trick in this household. <laughs> See, I have the fucking song stuck in my head too. All right, copyright coon, please don't come for me. I am but a simple, I am but a simple creature. <laughs> copyright coon, please, 
these are looking Yeah, watching me sketch is like the most frustrating thing you will ever see. I never finished Clan Ad. I, I think I watched like three episodes. <laughs> this is to the utter upsetness of people that I live with. <laughs> I just never watched it. I, I don't know. It was never a thing when I was like younger. Like. What do legs look like? What is anatomy? Is it? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of... It's like you walked into an exam for the wrong class. That kind of works. need a different angle though maybe like sideways Bonk. okay yeah that looks like a leg there we go we have something resembling a fucking leg that can die then <laughs> I heard like Planet and Elf and Lead were like the ones that I heard a ton about when I was in like middle school, but never actually watched. Uh, I I know a little bit about Planet now because I saw a little bit of it, but I know nothing about Elf and Lead. I've literally nothing about Elf and Lead. <laughs> also, I feel like you could tell when I'm streaming from my own home versus the Brimtone Studio for the sole fact that there is a giant fucking lamp behind me giving me light. And it makes my webcam very upset with me. <laughs> well, now we do that again. Oh, no, don't do that. Uh, I finished Oron a little bit ago too. I, I've just been rewatching all of my like blast in the past ones. <laughs> Hey, now, to be fair, mythology is also a great psych teacher. Just just look at what's going on with fucking Zeus and Hera. I'm going to make the hair this color so I can differentiate it. Mm. I'm trying not to hum the scene, the scene song because I don't want to get to, like, I, I don't want to go to YouTube copyright jail. But it's also, like, they have such catchy fucking music in it. Girl Demo is like a whole ass like album of like a ton of songs that never made it into the show itself. Like, it's awesome. <laughs> Can you tell me what the fuck Elf and Lead is about? I don't know what the fuck Elf and Lead is about. <laughs> no, I think I might want to do her in like a wedding dress because I hate myself. I think I will, just because I hate myself. And I'm still gonna try to keep her, like, thingies. I love how everybody else's uniforms at least somewhat make sense, and then there's just Yui over here just doing her own little thing. And again, she, like, from what she said, like, she watched a ton of, like, rock shows and such. I want to rewatch Soul Eater 2. God, that sh that's next on my list. I fucking loved it. Like, that was such a good one. That was, like, my middle school right there. Okay, now she just looks like the little bitty bits. What's the name of the song? Oh, God, the one that they're, like, playing when all the sad shit happens. Like, every time something sad happens, they play that one song. Because that's what's stuck in my head right now. So I think the song they play when everything is sad. Fuck you just pasted. Can 
That works. I want to know if, like... Five days of Soul Eater? <laughs> I don't know. Soul Eater starts off kind of heavy, too. Like, now I think about it, like, episode one goes from, yeah, we're teen, to all men are sexist and I'm depressed. Like, immediately. I will say, the character that I loved the most that I wish got more screen time was, uh, Subaki? The hot, the hot lady who could be every kind of weapon. Like, she was dope. And she had, like, sad backstory. I live for that sad backstory. Okay, we have, like, a vague idea of what the fuck her hair is. <laughs> Honestly, this is probably frustrating to anybody who does art to watch, but just, just, just to be assured, the drawing these models was it the sketch layers are even fucking worse huh i did not know that i need to look more into like who does the themes for stuff uh hachi my favorite vocaloid producer the one who sand planner i think is the most popular one thing he's done but he also did stuff like matryoshka and ah uh, what the fuck did i do i covered this panda here how the fuck do i forget I spent hours working on that cover and I still forgot the name of it. Uh, he actually did season two's opening for My Hero Academia, if I remember correctly. Like, he still does Vocaloid stuff under the Hachi name, but he does like, he has like a whole ass like professional music career that he does. hair is like super straight that's hair that resembles hair <laughs> yes yes she is I <laughs> Subaki is wonderful she was like the one sane one the poor girl <laughs> she had like a reason for picking black star and God, this girl has like so much detail to her design that I never noticed. I don't know. I love, I love reading manga and like watching anime. Obviously, I'm a fucking weeb. But I think my favorite part is when you can tell who is the who is the author's favorite to design. It's Yui. It was clearly you can't see what I'm doing with my hands right now, but it was clearly Yui was the favorite for the design. <laughs> I think I do want to do her in a little wedding dress because I'm sad. Okay, so now I wear that punk and I wear the bluish color for her dress. Who's gonna marry you guys? Who's gonna marry you? <laughs> God, I need to stop watching sad shit. I feel like she'd want a really girly dress. Like, all she ever really wanted from what I, like, from the show that I've seen is that she just wanted to be a normal girl. God, that show destroyed me. I'm gonna do that. I think she'd like that. I want to give her a bow. I feel like she'd have a bow on her dress. Give her a little bow. Whatever, Veil. I don't know. I don't know what wedding dresses look like. This is just me giving my fucking best educated guess. <laughs> what is fashion? How does fashion work? I don't know. Now I gave these dudes like no detail. Um, hmm. How do I jazz you up? What 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 do dresses look like? That looks like something. Okay, now we resketch it again. More line art. It, it depends on how energy I feel. Mm. 
my art style is a lot of just happy face. <laughs> I'm sorry if you thought it was anything but. <laughs> I also draw with one pen size. Ooh. See, everybody else loves watching the artist struggle to draw the circle, and I'm just pain. Pain chuckle. Hey, you can marry Iwasawa, okay? She was cool, but she, Yui just needs a hug. Oh, and then there was Kanata. Kanata also needs a hug. God. Honestly, every character, I, I guess the whole point of the show, actually, every character needs a hug, but everybody needs a fucking hug in Jorts. Although the bassist was a cute blonde in Girl Demo, and I love it. I don't like changing my brush size, so I just like my entirety of my art style is just very carefully applying the pen brush. Like it's just very careful. <laughs> True, but like I don't know, it's like a thing. Like any the dress that you wear, like a lot of girls, I like, take a lot of consideration to that, and it's a very important part of what they're wearing. Like, oh, I can make her bows like actual, the little bow things actual bows. So I'm gonna drop down now because I'm not focusing as heavy on her face. So I'm gonna go in for a hair. I like to do, to do the hair because I get to do aggressive strokes. Oh wait, no. Were you a good line? No, you were not. You see, I don't actually look at what my line art looks like. I just aggressively hit control Z until I feel like I've hit control Z enough. Yeah, I was gonna stream at like nine, nine-ish. It's 11.30 now here for reference, but I was so upset by the episode, I had to take a little while to just wallow in my sad. <laughs> I mean, I'm still not completely unsad. <laughs> oh, I wish I could draw another fucking stupid line. I wish I had brain cells. You ever just wish you had a brain cell? At work, uh, me and the girls I work with, it is a running joke that we all have one brain cell that we share between the three of us. His name is Jimbo. We would be lost without Jimbo. If we're really like stressed and like a rush, we will say, okay, it's your turn to have Jimbo. <laughs> yeah, honestly, everybody does need a hug. <laughs> I know TK, uh, the the rapping dude who like only speaks in English in the dub in the sub version, like the original Japanese one. I forget if he actually had a backstory or if they like it was a fan dojin that gave him a backstory. I want to know what the fuck was up with purple. I never read the manga for this, and I honestly might just for the sole fact of I want to know what the fuck was his deal. He was a he was a butthead. Okay, yeah, now I got that right this time. I hope it actually goes. Yeah, she needs her, her things. Ah! 
I suck at static objects. <laughs> art is hard. Don't get into art, okay? It, it's the worst. Just, just don't like drawing. That's the wrong layer. That's a thing. Bonk, bonk. Bonk. That's a face. It's face shaped. We're gonna do a layer count at the end of this just to see how fucking awful I am. <laughs> hmm. Lurk, Shoji. Lurk. <laughs> God, that, that, like I don't know. I have a tendency to rewatch shows because I am always doing something. <laughs> Excuse me. That 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 was so exciting. I had to burp at it. <laughs> but I have a tendency to like rewatch shows like uh, NCIS. If you are from the land of hamburgers, I will rewatch that show. It ends at season ten for me. Okay, it ends at season ten. There is no further season past that show than ten. I have gotten in a very serious debate with my customers about this fact, because a lot of people here watch NCIS apparently. But like, I will rewatch that show in its entirety, all ten seasons, in like two sittings sometimes, if depending on like when I start watching it. Just because it's so good. It just, it just, it's my comfy show. I grew up watching it, and now it's my comfy show. Did I do this in a new layer? Yes, I did. Okay, thank God. Uh. Also, Full Metal Alchemist, I rewatched that recently. I don't want to redraw both the hairs on both sides. I want to try to give them uniqueness, but I do not have any will in my being to try to redraw this bow again, so we're going to do this. I can hear the League player in the household. He just oofed. I'm so sorry, League player. I don't know what happened, but I heard that oof. I felt it in my soul. It's really fun when you have to gaming slash streaming nerds in the household. I got educated on what bitrate is. I don't know what I did to fix the bitrate. It was fixed for me. But yeah. <laughs> I don't know how things work. I just do them. Alright. I'm trying not to go like super ham heavy on perfection. Because I do have carpal tunnel, and I try to, you know, give my hands a bit of a rest when I can. Because I'll, like, if I wake up, if I wake up sometimes, and I don't wear my wrist braces because I am a dingus, I will not be able to close my hands. <laughs> my right wrist is way worse than my left, but like, I, I have to be careful. I have to play the bass with wrist, wrist braces on at this point because I, I, I'm stupid. I'm very stupid. I don't like how this hair looks. Go right there, man. So like, I, I don't know, if I have like any life advice, just take care of your wrists. <laughs> All of my hobbies involve my hands. That sounds really bad, actually. Oh, wow, I swear I'm not like secretly giving hand jobs. <laughs> I wonder if that's a streaming category. See, th that, that's like an untapped market. Actually, no, never mind. That's not an untapped market. That is literally a uh, fucking chatterbait. Okay, I'm family friendly. I lied, I am just gonna copy paste her little pigtails. This is, the, this is definitely the artist's favorite character design. Like, you can just tell, like, if you look at the characters in any anime or manga, just, like, take a second to look at the character details. Like, obviously, you know, background characters and crowds are just gonna be, like, generic dude. Who just looks like dude. He's there. But then there are definitely the characters who are just like super sparkly with like hearts in their eyes and like all the little details with like a pretty necklace and like fanciness and I'm gonna do this. Like you can just tell who gets all the special treatment. And that was Yui. That's definitely fucking Yui. Like if you Stupid. <laughs> like, I didn't notice the little crosses before. And, like, her necklace, like, the little pearl. I never noticed that. I noticed, like, her strappy straps and, like, her little tail thing. 
It's like I never noticed the little details in her cross and like her uniform with like the, I don't know, it was a little pink thing in everybody's uniform. I genuinely forget. I, I just finished this anime like two hours ago and I already forget. <laughs> This is, I, attention to detail is not in my vocabulary. That is why I will never be one of those, like, super talented artists, like, do all the anime stuff. That's, like, gorgeous, like, wallpaper material every time. That's not me. For those of you just tuning in, we are drawing Yui in a wedding dress because we're sad up in here. <laughs> we're just sad up in here. It's, I... I wish I could draw dudes more easily because then I would totally draw them getting married, but like, listen, I am not an artist. I am a bitch who likes to doodle. Oh, what else? Have I, I rewatched Oron recently. Oh, I really want to read the manga for it. I, I read a little bit of it and I need to learn to start new layers. Kimari Dingus. Dingus. Sorry, I'm going to start a new layer. Yeah, I really want to continue that one. It was it was really funny, and I fucking loved it in the end. <sighs> I'm glad they didn't kiss in a way, because like that just leaves more room for like future awes. But then they never finished it. They never did it. It got the panty and stocking treatment. It's never a season two. Never. Where is my season two at? It was popular. You know how many people had, like, a little fucking honey senpai fucking Usachan? It's like, you cannot tell me that show did not make anybody any money. It's like burning money. It's like... It's like deleting money. Oh my god, this, this woman in her little cross thingies. Oh dear. They're super cute until you have to draw them. That's how it feels with, like, a lot of character designs, actually. Like, they're super cute until you have to draw them. Like my own boots. <laughs> Listen, I'm designing my own self. It was a lot of fun. Like I love picking out fashion, but just, just I, make your character barefoot. Just, just make your character barefoot. Definitely don't give them super long, complicated combat boots with seven billion straps and laces. Just don't do that. Just, just don't fucking do that. Do do. Okay, does that look like a cross? It looks more like a plus sign, but I have, I don't know, uh, shrink it, where is it, where else is it? I should probably actually look at what I'm shrinking. Oh god, long ear. That's the best we're gonna get. Here we go. That's kind of what it's got. I am the master at the copy paste T. I have been using this program for like 11 years and I know that like CSP is like the hotcakes right now, but I actually know I have a version that I got in like a survey giveaway, but I just never got, I, I never got into it. I, I've used this for 11 years. I have been with this since it was way more jank. I use the SE edition, which you can get on Steam that actually has like updates way sooner and has like a lot of cool like features and shit. Honestly, like, in a pinch, like, if I go to somebody else's computer, I will use Fire Alpaca, like, free. But then I'm just like, where's the, where's the text to image converter? <laughs> or where's all my filters? When I was making thumb, sometimes I'll make thumbnails at the Brimtone Studio because I am slow to the uptake and forgetful. And I'll get there and I'm, like, trying to do complicated shit. I'm like, where's my thing? I can't use my thing without it. Yes, let me just paste. Brain. Brain son, where did you go? There. Brain son left the. What the fuck did I just do? What did I just do? What the hell? Okay, so Fire Alpaca is haunted. Also, if the stream ends, like, suddenly, it just means the power went out. We've been having, like, super angry storms. Like, super, super angry. I, I, when I, before I went to work yesterday, I, like, woke up and just heard, like, <laughs> Like, fucking angry-ass thunder. It was, ugh. 
See, it's fun on days like this where it's my day off for three days. But then it's not fun when you go, ah, I hope that stops. I have to drive in that bullshit. I'm really jealous of areas with like super cool like subway systems, but no, 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 no. I live in the middle of rural but fuck nowhere. We don't we don't get fancy. I don't know. If you go to like one of the major cities, then like when you're only an hour away from them, it's like here we go. I'm close enough to cities to have halfway okay internet, but I'm far enough away from the cities where we don't get cool shit like public transport. Mm. Look at her. She's, she's too pure. She doesn't, she doesn't, des <laughs> she, she doesn't deserve to be sad. She just, she needs happy. There's a little necklace thingy. I forgot to draw the rest of her hair. I really just, I love drawing hair the most. I, I love drawing hair the most. Because it's just like fluffy. See, all the characters in this show have like super straight hair, but I fucking love to draw my hair wavy as hell. Like, the more waves and curl, no, nah, not straight up curls, but like, just the more heavy waves, the better. Because I can just make my hand do all sorts of wiggly shit. How do I draw again? How did I pick this hobby? Who knows? Somewhere out there in, like, an alternate timeline, there's a young Peabody who actually picked up, like, soccer and liked it. This is not that timeline. This is the timeline where... A goblin who ate SpaghettiOs for dinner is trying to draw an anime character from an anime that was like, oh god, how old is Angel Beats now? Oh god, it has to be like a, at least 10 years. God, I feel like it just came out yesterday. <laughs> oh god, I'm old. <laughs> I'm fucking old. on other monitor, other monitor, da 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 I think about it. I don't know. All of the anime I like are fucking ancient now, except for I need to watch the new Love Life. I have yet to watch the new Love Life. I specifically kept paying for Funimation just so I could keep like keep up with the new Love Life, but I have been terrible. Uh, for Nijigasaki, I actually stepped in at like episode three because I kept forgetting, and then I loved it so much. I was like, I would sit there and refresh the fucking page every fucking day, like near the time they would do the simulcast just so I could watch it. I fucking love that. <laughs> I is my wife and I will take no criticism. All you need in life is a cute blonde woman to make puns at you. Th th this is not up for debate. Okay, there we go. Now she's now she has hair. Now she has hair. <laughs> Did I merge that? I did merge that layer because I don't have brain cells. Okay. I was really happy that the girl demo basis was a cute blonde one. I liked the other guitarist. She was cool. I feel so bad for them though. Like they just keep losing vocalists. And I'm glad they kind of brought it up when they actually like disappeared. I am very much assuming that everybody who has watched this who's watching this right now has actually seen Angel Beats. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm very sorry. Yeah, she was cool, though. I liked I liked that uh, the brown-haired guitarist whose name I probably was told and just never bothered to remember. Oh, God, when that one guy got turned into an NPC, where they're like, oh, no, uh, what's-his-face got taken? I was like, which fucking one was that? <laughs> I... Th th 
I'm bad at character names. I really am. <laughs> I think it took me rewatching the show like twice to remember Yui's name. Yeah, like twice. I'm so sorry if you're watching like an emotional anime near me. I'm just, I'm awful with the names. I want to watch your name. I've heard it's really good. God. Uh, how do hands work? This is how hands work. We need to do like a Brimtone watch along at some point. Gotta find something that's just... I don't want to pick something that's too depressing, but I want to pick something that's just like... You'll be sad about it. <laughs> Not like Angel Beach, like not like my dumb ass going, ah, I want to stream today. Let me finish the most emotionally devastating anime physically possible for me to watch. That's great. This is good. I'm gonna rewatch Soul Eater. Troji had the right idea. We're just gonna we're just gonna rewatch Soul Eater next time. <laughs> this is not how hands work, but I honestly have not the patience. I thought about, I, I had like the fleeting thought of, oh, I save recordings of the streams. I can make this a speed paint later, but then you just see like, oh God, like 10 minutes of just Himidi head bopping action. Uh, see, that might actually be entertaining though. Just like, I am not still. <laughs> Look at her. She's just so sweet. <laughs> like every character in Angel Beats needs a hug, but she needs a hug the most. <laughs> and also Euripi. Euripi also needs a hug. I loved her English VA. I, I just, I love her voice and I, for, I forgot to go look her up, but I fucking love her voice. Her voice is just good. Uh, how does fabric work? And other mysteries I don't know. That yeah, works. Okay, so you just don't get into art. You think it's like fun and little doodles, and then you're sitting here with like eight hundred dollar tablet, going, "What happened to all my money?" Like maybe I don't know. Maybe you could have like a halfway decent computer, but no, I had to pick like the heroine of hobbies. I'm not gonna give this full shading. I just wanted to spend like a, about an hour just doodling a little Yui. I forgot to draw the rest of her arm. I don't have brain cells. I think Jimbo is on loan right now. One of my coworkers is probably doing something stressful. Uh, now we get to fucking figure out how the hell fabric works. References? Don't know her. I probably should have looked up like what a wedding dress actually looks like and not my half-assed attempt to draw a dress that I'm probably just gonna add sparkles to. But to be fair, I fucking love sparkles. Okay, once again, the left side looks dope. The right side looks like a fourth grader drew it, so we're just gonna do that. Is this which is the right instead of the other one? Okay. We're pretending that's okay. Everybody everybody just pretend. I'm gonna post this later and we're all just gonna pretend, okay? Oopsies. I need to make like a fucking oopsies compilation. How many times can one dumb bitch say oopsies when doing a hour sketch? Oh yeah, I forgot to give her a little bow. A little bow. There you go. The one asymmetrical thing, and it's because it's a fucking bow and they don't have shapes. We're pretending they don't have shapes. We're pretending, okay? <laughs> Bow. Seriously, this is just. It just. 
it's so amusing to me. Like, you could just tell she was the artist's favorite. <laughs> Get yourself someone who loves you as much as the mangaka of this loves Yui with all of her extra little details that nobody else got. <laughs> Oh, except for, oh god, who is this is so stupid girl? Oh god, what the fuck was her name? But yeah, she also had some fun character details. I liked her too. She got like no actual characterization besides she likes cute things and honestly, that's just a mood. I never actually watched the Japanese dub, I don't think, so I have no ability to gauge how Kanata's Japanese VA was. I don't know if the emotion... I know the emotionless thing was probably part of the requirement for her, but I don't know. It was interesting, especially towards the end where actually, like, she seemed to feel things. Which just broke my little heart. I wish she could have stayed. Why didn't she stay? Why'd they have to do that to me? I am... I'm broken inside. That does not look like a foot. It looks like a camel part. See, I would say like maybe she's secretly part camel, but we see a lot of we see a lot of parts of a lot of girls' flesh in this this show, so I don't think she could keep that secret. That looks like a leg. This is so fucking scuffed. Okay, what is this? Okay, now she has legs. And she can actually use them. Am I forgetting any other part of her fucking... Oh, Jesus, there's a lot of layers. Am I forgetting any other part of her? She seems to have parts. Okay. Oh, God, this is so fake. This is um... That's a PC thingy. I never watch other art streams, and honestly, I feel like I'd feel terrible if I did, just the sole fact of watching these, like technical terms and smart people things and I'm just sitting here like that's the PC thingy okay, we're gonna make a folder for the color layers <laughs> oh a fun art trick that I had to show some friends the other day if you want to color inside the lines and just use clipping layers what you do you select the outside of the art like so you select and inverse it so you have this inside selected you I'm gonna pick this gorgeous puce green color that is just totally lovely. Oh, they're never gonna match. I'm so glad that makes sense. And then, bonk. Now this is your base layer. Layers over it, you can go clipping. And then what you can do, ba bam. And if you don't like it, just kill the clipping layer. And you also don't go outside the lines or forget parts inside the lines. It's big brain. Now I get to figure out how the fuck I'm gonna color pick this. We're gonna just gonna pick some approximations and see see what happens. That's hair, that's hair, that's hair. She has a lot of hair. All of the girls actually have like a lot of hair. Like the the artist really loves like the 90s spiky hair with like lots of bang. If I have to like pick a era of anime art that I like, I don't know, they, they all have like fun little qualities to them. And like obviously the 90s is all about that spiky hair. <laughs> hmm. I'd have to say I like the new 2010s kind of stuff. Maybe I'm just being an anime boomer, but I just like how it looks. <laughs> Let me get to check that layer. Let me bring this. If anybody has another depressing anime to recommend me, let me know so I can never fucking watch it before stream. My heart hurts. <laughs> I am pain. I am totally just... She looks like... Uh, right now she looks like the Madoka at the end with like the pretty white dress. Who knows, maybe that's what Yui got reincarnated as. She can never not know pain. I forgot those parts of her hair. 
Yui just has hair. Thank you, artist, for giving me, like, some ease of color reference. She seems to just airbrush very specific areas, so, like, I have good black colors to pick from, which is not what I expected at first glance from this art. I wanted to pick something that wasn't just, like, me mindlessly taking somebody else's art, like this is official art from the show, <laughs> or the manga. Pop, 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 legs, legs. Okay, Yui has flesh now. We're gonna steal this color for her dress. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Nah, actually. We're gonna make this that bonk. And we're gonna bonk that down a bit and give it a little bit of a blue shade. Kind of pop it a bit. We're popping. Nah, that's too dark. Nah, that's too blue. I think this is an appropriate level of color here. Bonk bonk. Did I forget to draw the rest of her bow? We're gonna pretend it's a short bow because I have not the the patience to go back and fix that. Mm. We'll make her accessories that color. She's just such a sweetie. <sighs> this, this poor girl. I forgot a lot of the show, so when I finally got to the ending, I'd forgotten pretty much all of the ending. So I, I don't know why, my brain was like, oh yeah, they stay together to help people, and then when she actually fucking disappeared, I was not emotionally ready for that, and it broke me. I was broken. <laughs> Alright, and then... Lighter... I, I picked blue as an accent color, and then I totally disregarded my own choice. She can have pink as an accent color. Fuck five minutes ago, humidity. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Mm. If I can stay that color, I can only make her a pink shade. Things that nobody else will notice but me. Bonk, bonk. That means I can't keep her. Whatever the fuck you want to call these, that color. She's such a sweetie. Okay, we're gonna keep the veil that color. What the fuck did I just do? Fuck. We'll make her little thingy that color. Now we'll make it like a prettier red. Yeah, that's how colors work. I know color theory. Okay, now I have like a sort of fucking, her shoes are just gonna be a color. See how we've gone from that hideous ass pew screen that I picked to like actual colors? Yeah. I'm gonna just a little darker to break it up a bit. Now it's just me trying to make this resemble an actual drawing and not just me BSing the colors there. No, that's not too dark either. Alright, I don't want to give this too much detail, but like, we're gonna give it a little bit real fast. Another fun trick is to fucking check your bucket tolerance. Because I am constantly adjusting mine to whatever bullshit I'm trying to put it through. I lied. You see, I am a liar. That means I lie about things. Oh my god, why is this hair so spiky? After this, after this, we're done. I swear, I swear. I can't say I swear to God. That that's not how that works. If I swear to God, that that means I'm definitely lying. <laughs> yeah, see, it just looks happier with this. I don't know. Maybe that means I need to work on my 
art depth. A lot of my art tends to look a little bit flat and I want to fix that. But that also means like dedicating even more of my very thinly stretched time. Don't be like me. Pick one thing that you want to do and stick at that. Don't pick like 17 hobbies and then go, oh no, I never have time for them. Because then you're just sipping dumb bitch juice. I am not sipping the dumb bitch juice. I have a gallon of it. Mm. Bonk, bonk. 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 I would like to congratulate Shoji on graduating from the dumb bitch juice. He was setting his streams like really early. <laughs> and then... He lives a lot farther away from the Brimtone studio than I do, so he would get there like very close to time, if not running like onto it, because we live in a state of very stupid drivers. Bonk. Bonk. Okay, she looks like a vampire. I need to fix her colors a bit. Maybe that's how she stayed in the world. No, that's a little bit too dark. I need to pop these in here. Okay, slightly less vampire. Better color, better color. All of her color palette really did come from just her uniform. That's interesting. I didn't quite realize that. Like, everybody else was, like, really nice color contrast, and Yui is just pale. She is a vampire. That's the secret. Here, maybe give her eyes a little bit more detail. That might help. That's the same color I already picked. Me swimming in the dumb bitch juice. I just love her so much. She deserves it. She deserves the world. <sighs> fashion design is not my passion. Neither is graphic design. Think we're at a stopping point in a second here. I am a dirty liar, so never listen to me. Okay, okay, okay. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Okay, we're gonna stop here, or we're going to be here for like all night. Wait, no, I lied. I want to fix this real quick. I am a liar. <laughs> I just want to give her dress some depth. <laughs> I don't know the stop button. <laughs> like, the week before we went live with the band, I was like, I want a cat. And Shoji was like, you have too much to do. Don't add a cat. So you know what I did? I added a cat. This is Jellybean. I added him anyways. He followed my blinking and fuck you. Where did like my Nut Oh, that's what happened. I drank my dumb bitch juice again. Okay, and I don't want to do anything to those bottom layers. I am going to do real quick. Let's do a little airbrush. I'm gonna do that. Uh, I'm gonna make her like. I'm gonna do a little pinker. Bonk, bonk. Me. I am just a liar. I am a dirty liar. Look like the elf of fucking Christ. Look at this sweetie. She deserves the world. No, stop that. Stop that. Stop that. And now I'm doing this because I am a fucking liar. bit of this. Now I gotta fix my mouse again. Sorry, it's taking a second. I don't know where to stop, you see. This is why I don't do real line art. If I did real line art, we'd be here all day. 
Okay. We're, we're looking more like a Yui. Time to merge my 18 million fucking wares. We were on 20. We have come out of this with less camel parts than I expected. You gotta try to keep focus on your art towards like, not like that, towards like the important things. Like you wanna stare at her little cute face being happy because she deserves to be happy. She needs to be happy, goddammit. <laughs> so I'm trying to just do little subtler ways to kind of draw you towards the face. Because art is basically psychology. It's scary. And then finally, a nice little trick you can use to get your line art to kind of pop is to dupe your line art. If it's protected, unprotected, 